There's one word that Scientologists are not allowed to say. So today, we're gonna see if we can convince them to say it for $10,000. Did you say the word Xenu? Xenu. Xenu, see that's how easy it is. Sorry, we were just kidding, that was just a joke. But uh, <laughs> we can see how easy it would be to win $10,000. So now, now we're gonna try it for real, so let's, let's go. Oh. Hey. No, we're actually uh, famous influencers. Our sponsor said we have to give away $10,000 uh, this person on the street, so we're just looking for people to give away money to. All they have to do is like, Thanks, All you have to do is just say the word Xenu and you get ten thousand dollars. For ten thousand, show them the money, man. So I'm not gonna do it. Really? Yeah. Ten thousand dollars? Really? You could. Don't really find me it was really hard for us to actually get the sponsor. We had to do a lot of negotiating, and like we don't get the money unless we can like successfully give it away. So you wouldn't say Xenu for ten thousand dollars? Why wouldn't they say Xenu for $10,000? What the fuck is that about? So Xenu is a very powerful alien that Scientologists actually believe in. It's the alien that banished all humans to Earth in their backstory. They think that Xenu is so powerful of an alien that if you learn about him before you're at the third level of their church, then you'll literally get pneumonia and die. So it makes perfect sense why they wouldn't say it for $10,000. But we're not giving up on getting a Scientologist to say his name. I guess we have to be more creative in our, our ways. The plan now is you're gonna walk up to and, to a Scientologist and try and convince them you have superpowers. You're, you think you can do it? I think I can do it. We got some spy glasses for you. Show Scientology your superpowers. <laughs> so another thing that Scientologists believe is that once you reach the upper levels of their church, you just get superpowers like levitation or mind reading. So our plan is if my friend can convince these Scientologists that he already has these superpowers, they'll probably think that his brain is advanced enough to handle topics like Xenu and, and we'll just say it in front of him. So let's go. Hey, how are you going? Is this a is this a religion or church or? Yeah, this is a community thing that we do. But this is non-religious. But what's up with the band? Yeah, we're doing a Whoa. band right now. But you got something going on that you need help with. Hey, are you okay? Are you okay here? Just sometimes when I move my hands, kind of quick, people can feel it. I don't know what it, I don't know why it is, but it is what it is. So it's actually really random that you came and I met you just now because you have what you have going on. Yeah. And I've helped people through what you're running into. Wait, your birthday is March 29th. Uh, no way. Well, How do you know that? Because I know. I can just read stuff. Now that these Scientologists know that my friends can move objects with his mind, but not just that, also mind read. They're treating this like an emergency. So if you can get like at least one foot in the door, I can show you how it works, and then I can help you. But my friend didn't want to spend the rest of his life as an actual Scientologist, so he ended up bailing on the plan. He tried to pull me in there. I was like, fuck that, I don't want to go inside. Uh, they didn't say Xenu? Uh, nah, I didn't say Xenu, nothing. Dang it. Maybe I'll say Xenu backwards. How is Xenu backwards? Xenu. Quenies. Quenies? Quenies. Whoa! The first step of the plan seems to work, and if you're wondering why I drew a fake mustache on myself, it's because we're going to the same building as yesterday, and I don't want these Scientologists to recognize me. A lot of our companies don't really like our music, we make very aggressive music. Like what? Well, like, I don't know if you ever heard of our band, like Quinnies? Quinnies? Quinnies, no. What what kind of music is? It's like, it's a, a subgenre of, like, of, a, of a, a, a screamo plus country. Like imagine like country like music. That? Yeah. yeah, country music, but very scream like, you go like, Whoa! What but is like, it called? Qu Quinis. 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 They took Suki's bait and fell right into our trap and said the exact phrase we wanted them to say. But now, my friend has to make it all the way back without being recruited into Scientology. You can do the, the, the seminar? Yeah, I don't think you could do it today. You should do the seminar, you can do it right now. This is gonna be the real challenge of the mission. Yeah, I want to show you I guess right now I'm on my, this is my cigarette break. He's a very, I'm, very war, war, hard work person. He came uh, here to do a band, Quenies. They, 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 the music is like screaming like country. Oh, I didn't yeah. him for the, for the, for the seminar. I'm in the, my break from work. I want to show him the, the first video of the book, the yeah. this. So I was just like passing by, I even apologize because I cannot go in right now, I need to go back to the studio. Here's what we should do, yeah. Uh -huh. He doesn't really have a lot of time. Yeah, he's busy. Yeah. 
We're gonna show you just the short version. Yeah, the short version. No, man, I, I really like got a tap. Can you can you call, call your boy? But really don't worry. Finish the cigar. I will show yeah. you the short version. You know, like I really don't have time to go in. Hey, just get in there. Yes, you can do both the seminar. It's only fifty dollars per person. Please look at my bed. What's it called? Uh, Huenis. 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 Yeah, Huenis. Huenis. Okay, ready? Yeah. Does that count? I think there are gonna be people in the comments saying that that doesn't work, that 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 is not worth it. This what would you think that we got him to say it? Should we go back and so we're gonna go back and actually try to get them to say Xenu without any tampering of the audio. Just Google text to speech. They charge people for this. What the hell? Xenu. Uh, let's go English to English and put like a French <laughs> accent on it. I know they yeah. pronounce their thes like Z. Xenu. <gasps> Zenu. That's literally Zenu. I, I really don't know how we're gonna pull this. How, how do we get them to say Zenu in a French accent? Huh. I'm kind of busy for my rehearsal right now, but, um, well, can you help me audition? No. I try to ask multiple women and they, I can get in tonight. I'm sure a woman will answer and say yes. Keep asking. Is this the new religion? That's the first one. Have a good day. Bye. Why can't you stand? Have a good day. Well, I just want to stay. I, I kind of want to know about the religion. Though. That was a major fail, dog. They, they don't want to rehearse with you? Yeah, they don't want to help me practice rehearsing my lines. Why not? I don't know. Cause they're busy. I don't know. They say I couldn't find anybody else besides them. These people are the people that didn't let me rehearse my line here. Yeah, these are the people. Sorry. Can you step outside, please? You can't go in. No. I'm this guy's uh, acting coach. That's great. This guy said that he tried doing lines with you guys, so you guys wouldn't allow him to do it. They're supposed to be French actors, and they couldn't help me rehearse one line. This is the new car that you got from the dealership. Oh, no, wait, that was their oh, line, that was not, that. not your line. Yeah, that was supposed to be their line. Oh. And then we stood there for, I think, like 20 minutes waiting for them to recite their line back. And they never ended up resetting their line back. They would have failed that audition if that was a real audition. What are we gonna do, guys? Uh, oh, fuck. Scrap the video. So I decided I had to escalate matters with my own religion that I actually got approved by the United States government. Scientology sucks. Yeah, we're gonna battle among the, amongst the religions. Scientology sucks. Change my mind. This is a Steven Crowder parody if you didn't get it already. Hey, you wanna change my mind on something? Really? You have no, uh, for whatever reason, I guess the security guard of Scientology agrees with us for some reason. Which is weird, because like he works for Scientology. And then we get stopped by a Hollywood Boulevard security guard. He says he's gonna call the cops. Why would they call the cops to us? I guess because you guys are like obstructing the view of the building. You have a permit, and if you don't, they give you a ticket. Do you really need a permit to be on the sidewalk? Yeah, if you're filming. Yeah, you do. Please. I literally have no clue who this is, and he literally won't stop filming yeah. it. Like, no, nope, can't stop. Me. I'm like, get away. So if you're the authority, you tell him. Because like, he said he's gonna call. He's gonna take it. So when they come, I think we're not doing anything illegal. I said we call the cops bluff, and I say we stay here. You I think Scientology is actually discriminating us against our religion. I agree. Too. The rules of the debate: no physical contact. We hurt each other only with our words. But be as violent as you can. Scientology sucks. Change my mind. Scientology sucks, man. What? Scientology sucks. No, no that's, that's my opinion. opinion. Yeah. Change my mind. I think Scientology sucks too. So I don't know. That's like, what's good about Scientology. So I, I wouldn't be able to change your mind if that's where you said we stand on the same side. We want you guys to change our mind. No, I, I agree with you. What's the point of changing our mind if everyone's no, agree with us? Scientologists Thousands of people are passing us. One person has to disagree with, with us. I want you to change our mind. But I don't, I don't want to change your mind. Is there like something going on? Because every single person that's down says the same thing you say. Oh my gosh, it's Xenu! <laughs> We finally found someone that was actually super down to change my mind. What is it? Sign oh, Sign I'm that. oh, yeah. All right, uh, Scientology, it does suck. I, I don't want to change my mind on that, though. But the, you sat down because you read the thing and you wanted to change my mind that Scientology sucks. That's what literally what the poster says. Yeah, I saw you read the poster. What is it? Sign oh, Scientology. Oh, yeah. oh, this is the trick joke right here. 
There's no trick in it. It's literally, it says it straight up on our poster and you read it. Is that, our sign really that hard to read? I guess we're on the same team, buddy. Yeah. Okay, fine, fine. Should we go on flyers since someone wants to do that? Should we go at least remote, at least? Yeah, ours are bigger, so ours is more factually correct, yeah. Hard at work or hardly worked, am I right? Uh, yeah, hard work passing out flyers. My flyer buddy just left. Ben, should we turn this? Oh, well, I guess we're the only ones handing out flyers now. Just took over their place. Been here literally the entire night, and no. the cops haven't come, so what do we do at this point? Uh, do you think the cops are going to show up soon? Because we're kind of banking on the fact that, we heard you guys called them like a long time ago. We're kind of begging on the fact they show up. Our video's gonna be ruined if the cops don't show up. We just want to get arrested. That's all we want. Can we shut down their whole building, dude? Shut down. I'd probably pay someone like minimum wage to just always be out here. Because not a single person's walked in that building since we were out here, dude. And we would literally just single handedly take Scientology down, dude. They would cease to exist. So here's the plan. I only need to raise like twenty to thirty thousand dollars to pay someone minimum wage to do exactly what we did outside of Scientology and if that happens, Scientology will get no more recruits, no more money coming in, and Scientology has to shut down. At that point, we either buy the company from them so they don't go bankrupt, or we, we tell them to give us like a 50% share to, to, to stop doing our Scientology sucks protest. At that point, we're basically part owners of a $1.5 billion business. Like, we can literally take over Scientology. We thought this video was just, oh, can we get Scientology to say Xenu? But now we're taking Scientology down. This was a twist. No one saw coming, dude. To so end this video, I was negotiating with my sponsors for like literally hours. And after they've seen how hard it is for us to get them to say Xenu, they've literally raised it from they're going to give us 10000 to they're going to give us $20,000 now to give to a Scientologist if we can convince them to say the word Xenu. So, what's the game plan? You guys walk up, you guys say, You want some free money? $20,000. There's a cat. I can't go up because Scientology hates me. So, I'm sending up two of my friends as I hide behind a tree, which is completely blocking their view of me. Game show? Yes, $20,000. Two questions. No, no, two questions? Looks like they're plotting on us now. $20,000. Walk and talk. How much money do you want, man? All you have to do is say Xenu. Xenu, bro. Hi, man. <laughs> hey, guys, would you like to win $20,000? Let's see. Yeah. Let's see what you put your money where your mouth is. There you go. All right. Yeah, all, right, all, right. Okay, all right, you guys just have two questions. What? First question. First question. Red fire truck. What color is it? Red. Yeah, you got it. You got it. It's right there, man. He's got it. Second question. Can you say Xenu? Xenu. Unfreaking believable. My friends had actually gotten the Scientologist to fully say the word Xenu. And a deal's a deal, so they gave him the $20,000. And right as it was finally starting to sink in for this guy that he just won a ton of money, another Scientologist walks up, grabs him, and pulls him away from his winnings. He's like, Xenu? And then the <laughs> other guy that was walking with him ripped up and grabbed him by the arm and started pulling him away. What the fuck? <sighs> We didn't get to give the money away for my first sponsored video, but but at least we accomplished our mission in getting a Scientologist to say Xenu. Good job, you guys did it, hell yeah! Yeah! We did it! We did it! We got them to say Xenu! Yeah! Good job, they let you keep the money! Yeah, we did it! You gotta keep the money! Yeah! 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 Yeah, we're gonna die. Well, you didn't actually like, tell me about that. So yeah, I, I guess I forgot to tell my friends that this guy's gonna die. I mean, the least we can do is, I mean, just try one more time to give him the money because, I mean, I mean, he did win it pretty fair and square. We're sure to give someone uh, their money. Someone in here won a bunch of money. We're here to give it to him. What? No, he actually did. It's true. Can we show you what he looks like? In the Sorry, I can't help you. You can't help me? No. No, we're trying to give someone his money back. And I can't help you. What? I can't help you. Why not? You seem upset. We're trying to... I can't help you, but... Sorry, I can't help you. Can't help you. No. no, we... No, we got a sponsor. I'm sorry, sponsor. I can't help you. But no, the sponsor is gonna, like, if I'm sorry, they don't I can't get this money you. to them, the sponsor is gonna think that we just, like, rip them off or something. I'm sorry, I can't help you. It's like a... I was actually really excited about the sponsor, too. I'm sorry, I can't help you. If I just leave this here, would you give no. it to them, or...? No, don't leave it. But it's free money. Thank you. Oh my gosh, it's Zenu! No. <laughs>